everyone, it is Carol. I'm the creative owner at Be Inspired Markets, and we have our day nine, correct me if I'm wrong, of 12 days of Christmas. Oh, somebody will. <laughs> Somebody's going to correct us. Uh, I lost count, so I apologize, but I did say we're going to finish off July with Christmas in July. So my husband, Bill, is watching comments. Um, I'm sitting tonight. My back has not been, at least in my opinion, the, the best, so I thought I would sit. <laughs> so there you go. I'm hey, Barbara, Barbara Brown. So how's the camera? Everything good? Oh, it looks a little janky, but... That's looks okay. pretty good to me. It looks good. So as you guys are hopping on, say hello. Let us know where you're from. Make sure that you're spreading the honey. Uh, we are all caught up with our giftaways. Uh, just for spreading the honey, comment you spread the honey so that you're eligible. And then we usually give it about 48 hours um, to let some people on the replay. If you're watching the replay, make sure you comment hashtag replay um, so we can see that you're here too. And then um, we'll draw for um, the winner. We do have, where is it? I have those camera first, please. We do have, I'm gonna wait for a few more people. Let's wait for a few, I need that, but wait for a few more people, because um, I got something on that. So, hey Joanne, happy Wednesday. While you guys are hopping on, I'm gonna put, we had, just so you guys know, this week is our DIY club is open. If you don't know what our DIY club is, it's an extension of this page. Uh, we craft all month long. You get extra lives with us, four to six uh, extra lives. You get extra exclusive projects, um, extra exclusive printables. Uh, Bill crafts with me, so you get to see us both in action. So there's just a lot of fun in there. Uh, we only open four times a year, so this week, as I said before, I will be talking about it because after this Saturday, it closes, and I won't be talking about it. So if you're interested in getting more information, just comment DIY Club, um, and we'll send that to you. So, But we had some ladies, so we have all those bees back there, um, our new ladies joining, so I'm going to... And we've got Leslie Fisher, Robbie Robinson, Renee Woods, Deanne Kozlowski, and BJ Gavallis. Um, we're going to add our bees. So as you guys are hopping on, hey, hey, Paulina, thanks for spreading the honey. So I'm going to have Bill do that while I'm watching. Connie's in Vegas. How hot is it in Vegas? Oh, Trisha's in Georgia. Are you the whole country's hot. I know we're roasting over here too. Hey, Jody, And we have lots of ladies on here um, that are in our DIY club. So you can just comment B sister. Um, I'm sure they'd be well, happy, happy to welcome you in. <laughs> we have a great, great group in there. We actually crafted with the ladies yesterday. Um, it's just a fun time. Spreading the honey. Thank you, Elise. What is Bill doing? Is he making faces? I can't see him. Or I'm not paying attention. <laughs> okay. So, got a couple more. So, only till Saturday. Marlene's first night watching. Oh, first welcome. Time. Hey, Marlene. So, I don't know how you got here. I don't know if Facebook pushed you here. Uh, make sure you guys get on our texting list. Um, just comment link, and we'll get you our text number. So, today is a fun project. Today is a gift, if you want it to be a gift. But... If you've been following for a while, I have a very popular craft that I created, I would say last Christmas or the Christmas before that. I don't remember. Um, but it's called the Biscuit Tree. And it's on the blog. And it's very, very, very popular. <laughs> um, and it was one that have many have recreated or have told me that they loved it so much. Um, if you comment link, you'll get the link to the blog. You can go check out the original. We're going to change it up. We're going to make a mini biscuit tree. We're going to do a couple different things that we did at the other one just to kind of show you that you could take an inspiration piece and you can make it your own. Um, it's easy to just you know take a piece and do it exactly how the other person's doing it, but give yourself time to let your creativity come out and you'll see how it blows you away. Um, so this is the original biscuit tree. So that's what we did. Um, so like I said, this is the inspiration, and we're going to just change it up. So um, 
I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, somebody said, it looks like you might have a little paint on the camera lens. I don't see it on my end. No, oh, it's on Bill's head. <laughs> that's the logo. That's the Be Inspired Market logo. He can take it off. Hold on. Let's see if we can. How about if we just leave it? Now that they know what it is, it's not that big of a deal. You can leave it. <laughs> you sure? Leave it. Yes. Leave it. Okay, we'll leave just it. Just leave it. Leave it. We'll leave it. Before we have to chase you to the kitchen <laughs> for something. It's 102 in Vegas. Um, yes, welcome, Marlene. Welcome, everybody who's here. So, um, oh, thanks, Don. So, yes, we're doing the biscuitry, but we're putting a different, we're making it miniature. Um, so, I'm going to tell you everything that we're doing. So, this is a piece of um, wood. It is, I'll tell you the sizes and everything. So... <laughs> Oh, Jody's watching on YouTube. If you're here from YouTube, let us know because we we're kind of streaming in both places. We don't know that hurts our viewer count, um, but if you guys keep spreading that honey, maybe we can overcome that. It's eight by eleven, so that's the size of my board, and it's just a plain wood board. We're gonna change it up. This is too yellow for me, um, so I'm gonna do. I'm not leaving burnt umber. Um, I love burnt umber, but I tried this out earlier and I think it came out good. It's burnt umber and deco art white had a baby, and this is the color that's coming out. <laughs> that's random. How about we just That's what I was two. thinking when I was doing it. Like, what would it be? If white and burnt umber had a baby, what color would we come up with? So that's what we're doing for our base. You're going to see it comes out really cool. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like DIY club if you like to join us in the club. Um, like I said, give me grace this week. I don't want to hear that's all you're talking about because, yes, that is all I'm talking about. Um, so we have a lot of fun in here, in there. Okay, so I've got my white. Can't get that out of my head. It's really random. <laughs> now all I see is two paints. Like uh, Don said, I don't know if you can top last year's. We'll see. Last year, that all this whole this whole thing was created live with no plan in mind, um, and it was fun. Okay, so I've got the white. I've got the burnt umber. Like I said, you can leave. Um, you can leave this. As wood, you can do the burnt umber, but I've got a couple steps I'm going to do, and that's why I decided to do this. So very little burnt umber. Carolyn said, how do I get the printables from last night? Oh, and they're in the group. Who asked that? Carolyn. Carolyn, yes. I posted the link. I posted the link. Go back in the group. So in the DIY that, group, you can get it. Yep. That's one of the other things that, that Carol will uh, provide is printables within the club. Yes. So she's always exclusive. creating exclusive printables for the ladies or the men in the club, um, if if wanted. So, and usually everybody wants them because they definitely want to try the project that she was making last night. Right, Don, Don said that was the tree that everybody was talking about. Thanks, honey. And we sold out of. We didn't. I think every Harbor Freight, Home Depot, and Lowe's <laughs> sold out of wood biscuits, wood like the biscuits. little biscuits. But I will, here's my disclaimer on the wood biscuits. Um, oh, we have lots of you on here. So let me tell you what our um, little special gift away is for tonight. For tonight, I just need you to watch. I just need you to be here, and I just need you to be here till the end. At the end, um, I'm going to go ahead and pick somebody, and that person has to be here. And the reason you have to be here is because you're going to pick a number, one through five. And once you tell me your number, I know you're here, and I'm watching people as they're here. I'm going to see if you're at the end, um, one through five, and then you're going to get a calendar, one of these calendars sent to you. So. And she might not even it might not even be right at the end. It might be before the end. It might be in the <laughs> middle. So hold tight. You got, what are you giving away? One calendar? Well, yeah. Yeah, we'll maybe. See. We'll see. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Cerise, you're not too late. We just got started. Hey, Robin. JR made an eagle from the wood biscuits. That's cool. Oh, see, Robin said, what's fun now is that your videos are starting to pop up in my memories on Facebook since I've now been watching you. You've been here a while, Robin. Yeah, over a year. Janet said, I met it. Oh, yes. Janet made an eagle too with the wood biscuits okay so what i was saying about the wood biscuits you can get wood biscuits from harbor freight 
they are definitely different than the ones that I get from Amazon. So they are in the Amazon store. Um, <laughs> do not laugh. Do not laugh. I had a lot of biscuits product tricks planned in my head when I bought this box. We're going to start using them now. <laughs> but go to Amazon <laughs> um, and you can get biscuits. No, she didn't. You can get... <laughs> You can get a thousand biscuits. The size 10 is the size that you want. Um, again, I think the other one used a variety of size 10 and 20, but again, that's just our inspiration. <laughs> so I've got a thousand biscuits. Who knows? Whoever wins the calendar, you might just get a little bag of biscuits. Um, uh, thanks for spreading the honey. Okay, so here is white and burnt umber mixed. I put a little water and I have my baby wipe. So like I said, I just want this subtle like like bleached color. Like I didn't want a, a white um, and I didn't want a solid. And I'm going to just spray biscuits, more water. Are the biscuits in the store? Uh, they're in the Amazon store. They're in the Amazon store, Bridget. Yeah, they should yes. be. They should be. I put everything else in there. Okay, so you saw the water. Dandelion Pickens said, I need biscuits with honey. Right. You know, right? <laughs> the real kind, right, Tracy? Yeah. yeah, I think that's what she meant. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay. So you're going to see the before and after. So that's like the before, because I had the other side already done. It's like yellowy. But look how cool that is. So I didn't want to leave the yellow. Um, so I wanted it more of a bleachy. But when I did the white, it was too... Um, it was too white. And so I kind of like the burnt umber mixed in there because I think it just adds, don't you think so? Yeah. It just adds a different oh, yeah. color it to it. It doesn't look like, it doesn't look like wood. It doesn't look like wood, but it's not, you can still see the wood grain. So I did both sides. So that's going to be our base. Anybody that's late, I see, I've seen a couple people that have popped on late. That's completely fine. We just got started. You're jumping in at the right time. You can always go back and catch the replay in the beginning. No problem at all. But your punishment for being late is you got to share with five people. <laughs> right now on Facebook, share with five of your best friends. Not really a punishment. Oh, and Bill's got the we question of the evening. Jody, oh. you're supposed to remind him. We'll wait. We we'll can wait, wait for what? Till we get a few more on. We're at our limit. <laughs> We're not at our limit. But it's growing. <laughs> hey, Gloria. You ladies yes! are sure. Oh, see, Kathy said we made the sunflower biscuit. Sunflower. Yes, yeah, so that is on the blog. That was good. That was good. That I think those amazing. are the only two biscuit ones. Go to the blog. See if there's other ones. But I think those are the only two. Oh, Kirsten said, join the club. Best place to be. Great night out. Oh, thanks, Kirsten. And Kirsten is actually in Canada. So the nice thing about the club, it's open to everybody. You don't have to be in the United States to join. Okay, so that's my base. Now, from my inspiration piece, you saw that I had um, hymenals. So if you go to a Goodwill or if you go to a thrift store, um, you can find hymenals. You can find anything that you want. There's actually hymenal paper. Um, so that's the back. So I didn't want to do the same thing. I didn't want to do just the hymenals. So we have this stamp. Make sure you guys are here for our calendar giveaway. Um, we have this stamp. It's in the market. You comment link, you'll get the link to the market. Is that an IOD um, stamp? It's an IOD okay. stamp. Uh, just, just asking. <laughs> it looks like it was in an IOD package. An IOD stamp. <laughs> Is this, yes, Pat, it is a membership group. It is a private group. It is a paid membership group. Um, and uh, we craft all month long. You do get a craft with a supply list. Two, two nights we actually craft on Zoom. So we craft in the Facebook group and on Zoom, and that's the one where we do, it's called craft night. We give you a supply list. And then the other one we do paint night. So, like, we do those paintings that are behind us. If you um, would like to do Zoom. Yes. If Zoom not, is optional. you're welcome to join on Facebook. Yes. So, Zoom is optional. What is that um, one called? This one is called Kindest Regards. 
And it's just a really cool um, background. Writing is really popular. Um, you could do this on a tray. You could do this um, like in a picture frame and put something up on your mantle. But I thought it's words, but not words. It's like hymnal. Um, it's just going to be in the background. So, so Lisa, where do I find it in your store? So uh, just if you comment link, they'll say the market. Just go to the market and you can come um, just search stamps and it'll pop up. It's under DIY supplies. Okay. I forgot. Let me go get my thing. I'm, I'm right here. Always Robin say. said the club is awesome. Even more creative ideas and laughter and free entertainment with these two. It is so much fun. We love uh, it. It is fun. We do we have do. a lot of fun with you. We do. We love it. Okay, Jody. Jody said question okay. of the day. Hey, Karen. We miss you too. Ken Hess is with them. Um, Ken's Creations. He has a page. You guys could go check him out. We love him. We're doing the question of the day, Ken. <laughs> I would love to hear your answer. Yes. So hold tight. Here comes the question of the day. Here it comes. I'll read it a couple times, but let's see here. I'm oh, just conditioning. That's not my, a good one. I'm conditioning my stamp. If you use it for the first time, you just take this is like a hundred grit, and you just kind of want to rough it up. This is only the first time. If you do after that, you don't have to do it. I should have went through this. Oh, John says, I love the club. Thank you. Oh, this is a good one. Okay. Okay. Ken, you still with us? <laughs> okay. So the question of the evening is, ready? Jody, you hey, ready? Mary. I'm listening. Don't interrupt me. I'm sorry. I was about to read it. The question of the evening if you were a Disney character, who would you be? If you were a Disney character, ah! who would you be? Come on. Ken's ready. He said yes. He's ready. <laughs> All right, Ken. And Ken loves Disney. That's perfect. We didn't plan that one, Ken. I promise. Oh, no. I just, well, some of the other ones weren't as, I mean, we'll save those for another night, but. Who would I be? Who would I be? I wouldn't really know. Mickey Mouse. Yeah, Minnie. That was a Disney character. I'm trying to think. Like, who would I be? Goofy. Somebody said Goofy. <laughs> Eeyore. Snow White. All right. Um, you guys, keep telling us. I'm still thinking. So this is my stamp, and this is my brayer. We have that in the market, too. Bella. Bella from <gasps> Beauty and the Beast. Beauty Beast. Goofy. We got a lot of Goofies. I don't know who I would be, either. Oh no! Yes. Yeah, so somebody did ask. That's an IOD stamp that we have in our uh, market. We have in our market. And the brayer, I don't even need it that big. The brayer just makes it really easy um, to apply it. Like you could take the ink pad and apply it for Happy sure. Happy Le Pew. For who? You? No. no. Somebody said. That. <laughs> yeah. Who would you be? What? I just want to brush my hair with a fork. Who's that? Is that Beauty and the Beast? Dawn, <laughs> Cinderella. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to take my stamp and I'm just going to. I think I would be the girl from Little Mermaid. <laughs> I really would. Honey, I'm going to stamp. Don't make me well, I couldn't. I'd be a Little Mermaid girl. Yeah. What's her name, Ruth? The girl, Ariel. <laughs> yeah. Jenna's Pocahontas. Elsa for Janet. Yeah. Thumper. Michaela said Belle. Oh, Michaela said I would be Belle. Oh, I love Michaela. <laughs> Who's Michaela? Michaela, Nicole's daughter. I'm kidding. It was a joke. <laughs> he was kidding. Oh, Jody said, oh, or Jody, were you saying Ariel for you? Bambi. Oh, you guys are so fun. Okay. Donald Duck. We still not we still haven't heard from Ken, and I think Ken <laughs> jumped off. So Winnie the Pooh. Okay. So I'm just running my fingers across the stamp. Christopher Robin. Oofer. Oh, who's he? From Winnie the Pooh. Okay. And then we're going to put it up. Oh, oh that looks so look good. Look how cool that looks. That looks so good. Can, I, can you really? put it up on the really? calendars or something? Uh-huh, really? <laughs> okay. Look how cool that is. Can you see that? So, again, that's our inspiration, and that's what we're doing. 
I could easily put hymns on here, but I chose not to. So I'm going to dry my ink. Uh, Dawn said, come on, Ken. Oh, God, he said she's double duck. Love when he gets frustrated. Thank you, Tammy, for the stars. So the question of the evening, if you were a Disney character, who would you be? Who would you be? Simba. Ooh. It's kind of powerful. Mm -hmm. Pat just said, we're waiting, Ken. Happy Wednesday, Judy. <laughs> Dawn yeah, said, I love yeah. that stamp. That stamp is, is, very, um, is very popular. We only have a few left. Um, and if you guys have noticed, we're selling out a, a lot of stuff, and we don't order them right away because we have plenty of stock in other things. So um, if you comment link, you can get it in the market. Ken, I see your comments. He said, maybe my comments are not showing. Answer again, Ken. Before you jump off. Heather Allen. Oh, Heather's got her, um, her daughter's wedding this weekend. Heather just joined the club, too. Her little bee is up there. So if you want a little bee, <laughs> uh, join us in the club. Okay, so I have this to the side. That can dry. Then, peg like Pete? I don't know. Scooby-Doo. Um, you're going to need this um, form. This is from Dollar Tree. So look out for it when it comes out for the Christmas. It's come out every one so far. Um, I'm sure you are some, oops, sorry. We'll see. If you join the club uh, while we're live, make sure you let us know because we'll we'll do your B. <laughs> we'll live. put your B right on. We'll put your B right on. Um, ah, shoot, shoot. Oh, my goodness. What the what? Just <laughs> glue it. Just glue it. Okay, we'll figure it out. I think it's the last one we have. No, there's actually one behind you. A tree form? Yes. So can I get that? So just be yeah. careful. Um, right there on the side. Is it on the side or on the side over there? Yes, somebody asked before that um, these paintings we did in the club. Yes. Some ladies joined us. We actually had a painting challenge. You can still join that challenge. I think I still have it. Or no, I took it down, I think. I don't remember. If you go to our market and it's still there, you could still purchase it and get all the tracers and everything. Um, but I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, we did it, yes. So we did it with some ladies that joined us just for one time. Um, and then we did it with the ladies in the club. Mary Poppins. Hey, Michelle. So what you're doing is you're taking this off. You're welcome, Jody. Um, oh, Jody got her tree. I had some extra trees, so I, I gave them to the some of the ladies in the club that were looking for it. So it was kind of a fight to the end. Yeah, it was a fight to the end. <laughs> so we're taking this off. I should have taken it off before, but that's okay. You guys, it's okay. Have, you guys are good. Remember, we have. Oh, Careful, I keep cracking. Keep spreading that honey. Yep. Let's see some of the answers. Hope they get them again this year. They should. Uh, Dollar Tree is really popular for, or er, popular, um, consistent. Like, <laughs> there's very few things that they put out that are new. Sometimes they do, but. Heather said Tinkerbell, because I'm a little sassy like she is. <laughs> <laughs> I really wouldn't have noticed that, Heather. <laughs> Just through commenting. Yeah, and... that's funny. And you can save this tinsel for another project. I'm not going to lie. I don't save it. <laughs> um, that's just me. But you can, you're can. you more than welcome. I know some of our um, followers, they actually save that, like those little pieces. Oh. These little pieces, I remember Lori Stevenson last year did, um, she put these on like the trucks, like those wooden trucks that they do at Dollar Tree. So save those. Nicole chose uh, Tinkerbell just because oh. she wants to fly. <laughs> That's funny. I'm tired of the honey today. Oh, Sherry Wolf. Sherry Wolf actually, um, her husband's a beekeeper. Sherry is in our club. Um, and uh, yeah, we have to. Yes, we have to get some honey from you, Sherry. I don't like that tinsel. Yeah, I'm not a fan either, Kathy. I'm not. But it doesn't some really are. Bother me. It doesn't bother Bill. <laughs> yeah, wear like a boa. Oh, what? Jiminy Cricket, Nan Natalie oh. said. That's that might be you. 
Jiminy Cricket? Uh-huh. No, I was thinking Peter Pan. <laughs> Because well, you get a sword and you he get doesn't have a sword, honey. He flies in a green suit. Peter Pan has a sword. How do you think he fights off Captain Hook? Oh, what am I thinking of? I'm thinking, you're of... thinking of Harry Potter. Nobody know. knows what you're thinking of. <laughs> Not having merchandise, I see on the website, but store has nothing. Yeah, some of the stores, depending, I think they're each individually run or something. Okay. Let's get this off. Deborah just found us. She said hello. Hello. Everybody say hello to Deborah. And make sure, Deborah, you comment link and get on our texting. Um, but we have lots of you guys on here today. Yay. Um, make I know. Sure... We'll do Lady from Lady in the Tramp. Ooh, that's a good that's one. That's a good one. Um, we're doing a gift away that's separate. It's spread the honey, meaning sprinkle, invite your friends, do what you got to do. Then at the end, I'm going to pick a person. You have to pick a number. It's one through five. Um, and we have the calendars, and somebody's going to win a calendar, but they have to be present to win. Yeah. Okay, so here's your tree form. Because we're making a mini version, I'm going to cut off that bottom part. So it's plasticky. You could use scissors, but I'm just going to. Heather said Peter Pan, the boy that never grew up. Yeah. That's oh, my... that's a good one. Yeah, that is a good one. Yeah, you don't know. You were thinking of something else. What were you thinking of? I don't right? know. Yeah, he had a sword, Peter Pan. And he had those little short shorts that he cut, the green top. So there's your little mini tree. Perfect. 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 But we're not I done. like it a little smaller, but I'm okay with it. So if you could get a little board, this board is 8 by 11. So maybe go like 9 by 12 would probably be a better size. But work with what you have. But really... You could take that next bottom off. I don't want you to. No. And it would still be cute because yes. look, if you did that and then you put your stem down at the bottom, your but stump, should we cut off your the tree one trunk. Left? If you put your tree trunk, because now you got your tree trunk, it's taking up the whole background. Yeah. If you take this off, put your tree trunk on, at least you see more of the background. Yes, that's true. Just saying. Sometimes I come up with good ideas. Ladies, that's another oh, thing. Oh, what the, were we doing in the club? No, in the club. Talk about the club. <laughs> How I'm on my own now. Uh, just comment. Comment. Comment um, link, Deborah, and you'll get the text link. It's scrolling across the bottom. Just comment link. Yeah. Um, what? In the club, how I've come a long way. Oh. <laughs> Bill has come a long way. So just to tell you about that. So when we started, we have a funny story. It's called the candy corn story. So when Bill started. It's not a story. It was a project. It's a project. He painted the candy corn. It was less than appealing. I think Tammy Howard has it now. No. No. Allison has Allison it. Allison has Al it. Allison bought it in an auction. Um, so what's cool now is Bill crafts with me while we're crafting with all the ladies. And before I used to tell him, like, we're doing this red, blue, green, whatever. And that's it. He would just do it. Well, now he actually, like, sits there and comes up with it. So, like, last night we were doing some ornaments. And he was like, I think I want to add you. I think I want to do this. I think I want to do that. I, I added think... glitter. He added glitter. Um, so it's just really cool to watch him um, involve, you know, like evolve with his crafting. And it just makes me that much happier because I know if he's getting something out of it, then I know 100% the ladies in the club are getting something out of it because they share their projects too. You can Natalie, use the other one, Carol, it broke. The one that broke, you could have used for the shorty oh, one. Yes. 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 Patch okay. said now she can never look at candy corn the same. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's what we got. We got our little mini tree, okay? So basically, <laughs> we took out most of the tree. Deborah just said, thanks for all the hellos and welcome, ladies. She <laughs> said, this is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we have a great group here. We really do. Oh, Sharon, if you joined... Um, here, let me go look. If you requested to join and you didn't uh, get approved, let me go do that now. And I'll dress up my glasses. Uh, let's see. Let's see. And then we'll get to the project. Sorry. Stick around, though, everybody that's leaving. Stick around. No. You're going to miss out. You guys aren't going to leave. Um, Sharon, I don't see a request. So check your email. Nicole said, one of these days you won't be able to find Bill and he'll be you'll find him in your craft, <laughs> craft room. room. Crafting by himself. Okay, so now the fun part. So the fun part is um, you're gonna take your biscuits and I've got my hot glue. 
actually, I need my hot glue to go on. Dawn said, you'll love these people. They're just like family. <laughs> Thank you. Bill, did you sing happy birthday? I did not, but I will sing happy birthday on Sunday to my mom. Yes. We're and gonna thank you to Sunday. everybody that wished her happy birthday. I will make sure and show her that was so on sweet. Sunday. Yes, I will make sure and show her. Last I looked, which was about 3 o'clock, we had 155 comments of people wishing my mom happy birthday. Yeah, I don't see. I don't see you. I'm sorry. I got the email. Yes, if you click the button and you got the email, you did, should be in there. Kathy said, did you say biscuits? Biscuits, yes, yes. But I'll touch base with you, Sharon, after this. Spread the honey, spread the honey, thank you. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, I'm waiting for my glue gun to heat up. We're gonna glue this on. Did you and turn then, both of them? Um, yeah, and then we're going to start layering our biscuits. This is when everything starts to come alive with it. Um, and then, like I said, that's our inspiration piece, but we're going to make it our own. Thanks, on the Bill and Carol show. <laughs> Look at Bill. What are you doing? <laughs> Who said look at Bill? I know. Now I see him. Uh, Get her an ice cream cake. Yes. Janet Jones, that's what we're doing. That is we're such gonna a get nice, her an ice cream yes. cake. I want an ice cream cake for my birthday. Now she's going to get an ice cream cake for her birthday. That's and I'll funny. tell her I'll pick that's her up. That's funny. What kind should I get her, okay. though? Like a Dairy Let's Queen one? Yes, I would do Dairy Queen. Everybody's. Yes, comment uh, DIY club yes. for club information. And then let us know your answer to the question of the evening. And if you sign up tonight for the club, we got, a, we got a little B waiting for you. We'll write your name on it. And we'll stick you on the board with the rest of the ladies this week. Oh, um, Sorry, okay, so if you're new, did we even get Deborah, new Deborah's uh, answer? Do you ever attempt to decoupage over the biscuits? What a great idea. That's an amazing idea. That is an amazing, I wonder what would be like a quick way of doing it. Like maybe laying out your biscuits and putting the Mod Podge on it and then laying like your tissue paper or your napkin on it. That would look nice. Gene, sometimes if you jump out, jump back in, the freezing will stop. Because we're not freezing up on our end, so I apologize. Patches, are you going? Is she going for her surgery already? Patches, I um, think Nicole just said something. No, Patches said today is my twentieth anniversary. Even though my hubby is celebrating in heaven. Aww. Happy anniversary, Patches. We're here with you. Okay, so we're doing. Okay, so I've got my plastic on here, and I wanna. I'm gonna decorate the top. I'm not doing a bow, um, but we're gonna. it in the middle as much as we can yes okay. when you're commenting right DIY on. club just comment DIY club, club nothing else in it because we have it set to where you'll get an automatic message from us right away okay so we're gonna do something fun with the trunk okay so the trunk Sharon said the money came out of my account yesterday Carol so I'll Sharon I'll well Carol and I will look into it okay we'll look into yeah, it right but after she, said she got the email so if you got the email there would have been a link to the group um, but I will definitely message you and get you the link directly. Yes. Because um, once you've gone through the whole process, you should get an email. Um, and then you can do the group that way. So it, for the trunk that we did for the original um, biscuit tree, I took that cookie sheet from Dollar Tree and I literally just cut it and then kind of just put it up um, to make the trunk. We're going to do this one a little different. Like I said, I want to see, the goal of this is to see your version of the biscuit tree. Like I said, it's easy to see a craft and copy it, like, to the T, but putting your own spin on it, that's where your creativity comes out. Okay, so I'm going to do... Carol Close said, hello, just got back from Dollar Tree, got my case of pumpkins, but no good calendars. Well, Carol... <laughs> this Carol's got some calendar giveaways. You got to hang around till the end. So, okay. So this is just a paper roll um, tube, and we're gonna still decorate it. And I said this isn't the whole thing, so I'm gonna so I'm gonna put it this way because that end is even. So there's my little trunk. Is that too big? 
We're trying to see proportions are important. Angie said, this was my favorite craft. I made two of these last year. Did you really? That's awesome. Okay. Carol Close, here's the question of the evening. And you're the last one, so we're all watching you. <laughs> if you were a Disney character, who would you be? Okay, so that's what we got. So this is our little trunk, and then that's our little tree so far. Okay. Now I'm gonna I'm trying to see what's gonna be the easiest. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Using the tube is a great idea. Yeah, I think so too. Like I said, you could use the the cookie um what's that called? The cookie tin from Dollar Tree. Okay, so my thought on this, you could do anything with this. You could paint it. You could um, put napkin on it. Jenga blocks would be good. Jenga blocks is another great idea. You know what else you could do? Just because I'm kind of crafty like that. Go collect sticks in your yard. Hot glue them all together. Tie them with jute. Hot glue them all together. Yes. And then put it down. Like lay them flat so one side's flat. That would be perfect. Mm -hmm. Hey, Yvonne. Cool. Yvonne from Southern Designs and Finds is on. Hello. Um, oh, yes. Mary Poppins is perfect for Maria. <laughs> um, so what I thought would be fun for the, the trunk is I'm kind of getting into this faux leather. Um, I went on Etsy, and there's this lady, craft Craftific, that's what it's called, or crafty -rific. Crafty Rific, C R A F T Y R I F I C. Small business, support small business. I don't know her personally, but she has a wide variety of like uh, faux leather. I thought just thought it would be a different texture. You could so, do cork board for the trunk. Yes. Ooh, that looks cool. So this is the faux leather. She put this as a sample. I actually bought, because I had some projects in mind. She, I know you Buffalo Check ladies. She had the rug Buffalo Check. She had the black buffalo check. I've got a whole, oh, look. <laughs> um, so as you can see, Carol can't just go there and buy one. I have to go buy the whole rack. Um, but they're really cheap. They're like $3 a sheet. <laughs> uh, Lynn said masking um, tape over the toilet paper tube, then stain it. Oh, that's a good idea. Another great idea. So I'm going to do, I'm going to just... Um, Cork from a wine bottle. Yes. That would be perfect. I love these ideas. I like the cork idea. So. What do you use the calendars for, Patricia asked. The, the calendars? Patricia, you could use them as a calendar if you would like. Yes, you could use start them. number one. Yep. To number two, you could Mod Podge them on any type of craft that you would use. <laughs> They're perfect for a background of something. And there's many different styles. You will not know which one you're getting. But when Carol well, picks you're pick a, a name, number, mm -hmm. Carol will pick a name, then you're going to pick a number, and then you'll know which one you're going to get. <laughs> okay, isn't that pretty? This was just the sample that she gave me. I didn't order this. Um, but I love that when you order from small businesses. So here's our little tube. Can you imagine the possibilities with this, too? Um, so I'm just going to put a little hot glue. I'm sorry if I missed somebody's comment. If you set, say it again. I just saw Natalie say, Natalie said, comments go by so fast, I'm sure they're not ignoring you on purpose. Oh, 100%. We are, Nat, Natalie is 100% right. We are not ignoring you. I will tell you guys, look at my hand. This is how the comments go by. Yeah. That fast. I have to go back to read some, and I might miss one. But you know what? Ask again. Ask again. Yes. I apologize. And now from our sponsor. <laughs> Did we say something, Sue? <laughs> okay. No, I think it was the ad that popped up. Oh, was it? Okay. I think I would be Piglet. Diane, you would be Piglet? Piglet's so cute. Make this tree so crafty. Thanks for the live tutorial. You're so welcome. The original biscuit tree is on the blog. You could go comment link um, and go check that out. Okay, so that's what we got for the trunk. Out. So I'm kind of squishing it to make it flatter. Pam said sleepy. I'm sleepy too, Pam. <laughs> okay. There we go. Sue said, no, it was Bill, the infomercial. <laughs> They're saying it was like an infomercial. No, it was Bill. Oh, you're the, yeah, yeah Sue said it was, it was like you. An infomercial. 
Yeah, comment link for um, the blog. And the most important part, the whole part we're celebrating this week, is the DIY club that's opened. Um, it's our private membership group, and we would love, love to have you. So comment DIY club and get all the info. It's only till Saturday. After Saturday, we're closed, and we're actually going to start launching fall um, projects come April. And you get a schedule for the whole month. Um, okay, so now what we're going to do... Robbie said, Bill, did you see where I joined the club last night? Yes, Robbie, your bee is up you. there. You're already up there, Robbie. Yep. We got you. We saw you come through. Okay, so the way that I found it easier when I did it last time is I started from the bottom. And what your goal is... It's going to be a lot of hot glue. What your goal is is to cover up that green form. Now as you're doing it, you're going to see what works for you as what's going to be the easiest. Patches said, hey Carol, April's over. Did you mean August? Oh yes, Patches. August. <laughs> Thanks, Patches. <laughs> uh, Connie wants to know how your back is doing. My back is uh, feeling better, but I'll still go for a little attention on it. So yeah, <laughs> a little sore here or there. A little sore. But Carol doesn't care anymore, so he's like, Feel better. <laughs> I do. Is that regular glue or hot glue? What does the B on the boards mean? Oh, Kim, so the B on the boards are all the ladies that have just joined our, our membership group. Um, it's DIY Club. They call themselves B Sisters. And uh, we craft all month long and do a lot of other things there. So everybody that joined gets a little B. Where do I get the biscuits? Uh, Joy, you can get them at Home Depot. They're called joining biscuits. Wood They're really joining biscuits. Home Depot, uh, Home Depot, Lowe's, Harbor Freight, you can get them. But at Lowe's and Home Depot, they're not in the wood section. They're actually in the tool section right next to the tool that makes the little joining slot. So they're in the tool section. That's where you're going to find them. But the or, best ones are on Amazon. Amazon. So it, it, when Bill, if he wants to turn around... The ones from Home Depot and from Harbor Freight and all of them are more uh, like wood, like made out of this like bleachy wood. Um, and the ones, and they're size 10. So there's different sizes of biscuits. They're, for, they're made for furniture. They're not made for crafting. It's for joining um, two pieces of wood together. Yeah. So this is size 10 because there's different sizes. Uh, the club is $17. Uh, and it is our founding member price. So the next time we open, which we won't open until October, um, it will be slightly higher. So this is the last time we're opening because, and the reason for that, because I know some people are going to be like, well, why? Why would you do it more? The ladies that have been in there, some of the ladies have actually been in there since day one. When you join now, you have access to over 50 replays because the replays are in there. You'll have access to all the um, printables that we've done. Um, so that's the reason. That's the reason. Okay, so then your second layer, what you're going to do, and I'm going to lift this up so you can see. Okay, so that's all I'm doing. I'm going across, and then now my second layer, I'm going to go in between those first two. Can you guys see that? So you're going in between the first two. Somebody said, I wish I could join, but yes, I never know Karen. my schedule. You know what? You can always watch the replays if yep. you if you had to miss one or two. Yes, you can always some catch ladies the on there that don't um, come for the lives. They just come for the replays. Yes, Carol Claus is an original. Yes. Yes. Yes, she is. So is Jody. Jody Patches said, I think, from day good. one. Yes. Jody, too. Yeah. So you're just going to keep going through. Um, and I'll show you the second layer. So hot glue is going to be your friend. I made an owl yes, with the biscuits. Yvonne said. Oh, did she? Yep. Kim Stevens said, do you have an Amazon link for the biscuits? Uh, they should be in the Amazon store. So if you go to our website, just comment, comment link. Comment link. You'll get the website. And then click the Amazon store, and everything will be in there. So it's under usually um, the craft supplies. Can't this mini it. one is very cute. Very cute. I'm, I think I'm going to, I know I'm going to love it. Okay, so that's what you got so far. See so how you got the two rows? 
Maybe it's a birthday gift from my mom. Oh, Nicole's like, can you send me a picture? I love owls. Somebody oh, Kathy owl. Moran is an original. Yes. Thanks, uh, Kirsten. Okay. Oh. Carrie, if you comment DIY Club, you it doesn't automatically sign you up. You actually have to click the link, and everything is on there that you get with the club. There's a long list. Um, so, yes, you can definitely go check it out. Okay. So then your next layer... Because what you're doing is you're going up with it. Now, you're going to definitely want to cover up that green part. So. Michelle said, this may be inappropriate, but I keep thinking about flinging biscuits. <laughs> flinging? <laughs> I don't know. what. It, why is that inappropriate? Yeah. Right? Maybe I don't get it. But like a real biscuit, like thrown across the room. So. There's, a there's a restaurant that does that. They throw biscuits at people. They do? Yeah. Okay. So your biggest challenge, to be honest with you, is going to be like this edge right here you're going to want to cover. Okay. Sherry Wolf, it was um, glue strings. Can't oh, get that's that stuff all going on me? No, off of me. Oh. <laughs> all right, you're just keep going. Uh, tree form. That is a craft we made in the club. Which craft, Nicole? Uh, one behind us, maybe? Is there one behind us? I don't know. Deborah said, did I receive a link? I haven't seen it. Um, Deborah, you got a comment link. Yeah, if you comment link, it'll go to your messenger. It'll go to your Facebook. Yeah, Lambert's. Messenger. Lambert's. I think that's in Texas, right? They throw biscuits. Like real biscuits. Do they? Okay. And then when you get to the edges, you're going to want to make it go up. Oh, the Mary and Bright behind you. Oh, yes. Right there. So the Mary and Bright was a project we did in the club, um, and the ladies got a supply list, and then we crafted uh, via Zoom. Or Facebook. Or Facebook, yeah. However you want to join. Okay, I'm going to clean some of these um, glue strings, and then Tony, can you do me a favor? Not really. I thought Bill had spiders on him. <laughs> oh, I could have gotten it. I was kidding. I know. I know. Yeah, Lambert's. Oh, there's a Lambert's in Illinois. I didn't know that. Gulf Shores. What? A barbecue? Is that what it is? Or a steakhouse? There's a Lambert's in Missouri. I got to look that up when we get off, I guess. And thanks, everybody, for sticking around. Yeah. Spread the honey. Um, comment, spread the honey. Nettie said I just joined the club. <gasps> Nettie! If you join the club. Carol's going to double check. Oh, there goes Nettie's B on the floor. I don't want Nettie's last name. Yes, Nettie, weren't you, Nettie was moving to Lakeland. Nettie Kadiri. Hold on, I think we have more. Hold on. Jane Niece, she joined the club as well. Welcome. Hold on, where's the other one? Uh, right there. Jane, N-E-A-S-T, or E-S. Okay. That. Hi everyone. Is the behind the tree the tree painted behind you? It is, and we're gonna do some of that. Okay, welcome. Gotcha. Okay, let's get more biscuits. Tape. 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 Right. Tape. More biscuits. More glue. You guys are awesome. That's the one we used to go to too. Love Lambert. Heather said. Okay. So, like I said, I want to see. She said I want my B. She said I want my B. <laughs> you can um, you can text us your projects. We'd love to see them. Hmm. Nettie's building a house in Lakeland. That's, That's right. That's awesome. Nettie's been following us for a while. It's like right next door. Yeah, we used to live in Lakeland. We've we love neighbors. downtown Lakeland. Go to Harry's. Harry's, Nettie? yeah. Where are you coming from, Nettie? I don't. Know. She's coming up from north. I thought. From the nook. Okay, who's next? Awesome. Who's next on the wall? Thank you, all you um, ladies, welcoming the new ladies that are on here. If we just happen to pop up in your feed, thank you, Facebook. <laughs> um, the Facebook gods are on our side. Right? Okay. So we're just going to keep going up. Sony said, I got your message. Where's the club information? 
Just comment DIY Club. No, she already got the link, I think. Oh, the it's website. on there. So. It's on there. It's on. It's in that information. You'll see, yeah. I think, another link, right? That'll no, take you, you right to it. Right. It takes you right to it. Yeah. yeah. So click that link, and then I'll take you right to it. Okay. So the sides are probably the only one that you're going to really... Charlotte used to live in Lakeland many, oh. many, many years ago. Oh, she's coming from Florida by Dustin. Oh, okay. okay. Hey, Sherry Stubbs. So see, that's what you're doing with the sides. That's probably where you're really just going to concentrate. You just, you want it to look like a tree. So don't, don't have hazardly kind of put your um, biscuits all over the place. You definitely want to, um, have some rhyme or reason to it. Okay, so let's uh, see. Hold Jill on. said, just saw your text was at a going away dinner for good friends and neighbors. Hey, Carol, where'd you get the tree? <laughs> <laughs> the tree is from uh, Dollar Tree. My husband can show you. He can show you the original. It was these from, are you going to paint the biscuits? Yes, I am going to paint them. This so the tree. once you get to row one, oops, don't do that. One, two, three, four, five. Once you get to row six, I'm kind of sticking them underneath. This was the tree form, ladies, from Dollar Tree. So we just took the tinsel off. They seem to have them every year. Yes. We just took the tinsel off, and then Carol, because her board was shorter, she wanted to make a shorter one. Yep. She just cut the bottom off. The hot glue on the biscuit and then adding to there, you adding it to the previous row. So for this, where I was layering, I was actually layering it on the biscuit and then placing my new biscuit on top. On this sixth, so it's one, two, three, four. Wait, am I doing that right? One, two, three, four. On my fifth row, which is the one I'm doing here, I'm going underneath because I don't want it to be really fat. Like I don't want it like monstrous, um, I kind of do want it proportioned. So right now what I'm doing is I'm sticking them in there. Okay, so Kathy says, Ooh. I feel left out. I think I'm the only one from California. Ooh. I know we have other ladies on here yeah, from California. Do. So if you're from California, just say, hey, Kathy, I'm from California. Yes. Don't make her, oh, there you go. Sue Watts, I'm from Sacramento. See? See, Kathy, you're yeah. good. Nicole, I'm the only one from New Hampshire. I doubt it, Nicole. <laughs> Get some lobsters. Uh, hey, Tina. Hey. Daphne's from California. See, Kathy? Do we not know our followers? <laughs> Stick with us. Yeah, we would love to have you. Okay. Uh, Tina's from Indiana. Indiana. I know we got a few from Indiana. Okay, so now... Now that I kind of tuck that in, I'm going to go back to layering it on top of Jimmy said, I don't feel so bad. I'm the only one from Connecticut. Uh, no, you might be, Lisa. Sorry. <laughs> Lisa will laugh at that. She knows I'm kidding. I don't know. Melissa's New Hampshire. Melissa yeah. Lindsay. Nicole. Nicole Richard, meet Melissa Lindsay, your neighbor <laughs> from New Hampshire. Bridget's from Massachusetts. I like this game. Tell us where you're from. <laughs> Carol and I are originally from Chicago. I was born in the suburbs. Carol was born actually in the city, the northwest side of Chicago. Cubs fan all the way. Cubs fan oh, her whole yeah. life. City girl. Um, we moved to from the suburbs of Chicago to Lakeland, Florida. What, five years ago? Four years ago. Four years ago? Four years. Four years ago to Lakeland, Florida. Till we kind of wanted to get our bearings and figure out where we wanted to be. We love going to the beach. We like being close to Tampa. We kind of like that side, the golf side. Not that we don't like the east side, but we like the golf side a little bit more, at least for this time in our life right now. Um, and then we went from Lakeland to the next town over, which is uh, Plant City, Plant City, Florida. And that's where we're at. So we're in Plant City, Florida. We're about an hour from Orlando and about an hour from the beach. So we're kind of directly right in the middle. So now it's your turn. Where are you from? <laughs> Give us a little background. Some of you already know. So now I'm just layering. You kind of look at your tree, and you kind of know where your biscuits are going to go. Rebecca's from California. See, Kathy? 
Been in Texas since I was four, Leanne said. Born in Indiana, but been in Texas since four. Oh, Patches, Missouri's not that bad. She said the, <laughs> the state of Missouri. Mississippi. Oh, yeah, Patches always says that. <laughs> I don't know why. Mitchell's Bay, Ontario, Canada. Who's that? Canada. Kirsten. That's Kirsten. Kirsten. Yeah. yeah. She's got a beautiful view out the back. Oh of the yeah, house. she shares her pictures. Lynn is from Naples. That's a beautiful area. Mm -hmm. I grew up. Vicky grew up in Zephyr Hills. You know where that's at. Mm -hmm. That's close to us. Okay, so we're gonna keep going. Okay, Robbie wants to know: Are there any other Alabama gals in here? <laughs> Alabama <laughs> with an Alabama twang. Come on, <laughs> come on, ladies. <laughs> Oh. Kentucky, I know we have a few from Kentucky. Okay, let's. So just keep covering the green. So now I'm getting to the top. So I'm just gonna, just gonna. I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh yeah, Heather Allen, isn't she from Alabama? Mm-hmm. I thought, yeah. Ohio. Stephanie Howell, Ohio. just outside of Baton Rouge, Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Do you know where that was? Uh, Louisiana. I think that's how they say it, Baton. Baton Rouge. It's the French that's coming out of me. Baton Rouge. <laughs> Baton. Uh, all right. I hope you guys are having some laughs. We're doing a that's great That's one time. thing that we do here. We definitely love to make your day better. So you guys make our day better. Trust me. We we always have dinner and then we're like, you know, we're going to come live. And sometimes you just get comfortable on the couch. And you're like, hmm. Do we want to go live? And then we do. And it's but like then I get so on here and I see yeah. all of you and I just get yeah. so excited. It gets so, it's just so fun. We, we like coming on here. Kim's from Alabama. See? Reba's from Tennessee. Any Tennesseans? Is that how you say it? Tennessee. Tennesseans. I love Tennessee. Tennessee is so pretty. So pretty. That was like one of my first experiences when I was young. We had drove down to... Um, Florida, we went through Tennessee, and I love I love Tennessee. I think it's gorgeous. Okay, so Heather Allen said, South Carolina to Florida, to Florida, Florida to California, California to Texas, <laughs> Texas to Kansas, back to South Carolina, retired military. Oh, wow. That's awesome, Heather. That so I'm, uh... <gasps> Arlene Akers, I saw my phone ding. <laughs> Arlene Akers, welcome. So all you ladies that are joining, you are going to get an email. Um, get on our text list. Just text um, text us if you're not, and I will send you the link right when we get Girl, off. Girl, get so excited. I do. It's so awesome. I, I love do. it. I do. Um, I do. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so this is what we have so far. So all you're going to do as you're looking at it, you're just going to keep building it up, building it up. And so that's what we're doing. Yeah, Jackie, Tennessee is gorgeous. So Heather Heather had a lot of places she lived while Carol's doing the biscuits. I know some of you have heard it that have been with us since day one. I started out in when I was a kid in Des Plaines, Illinois, which is just right outside Chicago, kind of by O'Hare Airport. Moved from Des Plaines, Illinois to – St. Louis, Missouri. St. Louis, Missouri. Pam Novak. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Pam, welcome. We just love you girls. I just wrote on the computer. And then Bill will fill you in on the story. Sorry. It's okay. This is way more important. <laughs> Yay, we're for... so happy to have you. I'll just leave the pen open because I know somebody <laughs> else is going to. Okay, I'm looking one more here. Yeah, so Des Plaines, Illinois. To St. Louis, just Melville, just outside of St. Louis, Melville, Missouri. If anyone knows where that is. I don't. No, I know you don't. <laughs> and then Melville, Missouri, to Slidell, Louisiana. Slidell, Louisiana. Then from Slidell, Louisiana, to North Olmsted, Ohio, just outside of Cleveland. And then from North Olmsted, Ohio, back to Bloomingdale, Illinois. And then Blooming at Bloomingdale, Illinois, back to almost the same exact street we left on in Des Plaines. Oh. Back to Des Plaines, Illinois. I went to kindergarten with kids, and I started <laughs> high school with kids. That's fun. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. And my dad was in the witness protection program. No. <laughs> and that's all I can tell you. Uh, wow. 
Sonia, no, I'm kidding. Oh, I'm sorry, Sonia. If you're having a hard time signing up, we will get to. We'll take care of you. We promise. We promise. Sonia's retired army. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Okay, so I'm just kind of filling in some of the spots. When you're looking at your tree, you're gonna kind of see where a biscuit should be. I'm, I'm just being honest with you. Um, you kind of look at it and you kind of see. And you kind of shape it as you, you go You shape down. it as you go. Yes. You definitely shape it as you go. Dawn's from Gurney, Illinois. Dawn, oh. They got that. Isn't that a mall there? Yes. Was well, there Gurney was. Mills. Yeah. Gurney Mills. There was. Six Flags Great America. Yeah. <laughs> Who didn't go to Great America when you I lived know. in Chicago? Okay. And Gurney Mills when it opened up. God, I remember that place was... All right. And sometimes you put a biscuit and you realize the biscuit ain't going there. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Let's get, if you don't know this tip, take your heat gun and it will melt all your uh, glue streaks. So, like I said, this piece is inspired by the original um, biscuit tree. I love seeing you guys recreate things we've recreated here. Um, it's super fun, and uh, this is just another example of looking at something, being inspired, and making it your own. My nephew was in the Army. Oh, the I know you guys are all talking. He was uh, stationed in Fort Carson. Fort oh, Carson? Is that in Colorado? Yeah. Yes. You are just there. Yes. Just there okay. this weekend. Okay. What okay. a great tip Jill said. That's a great tip. Okay. I'm trying to see. Great tip Jill Thank said. Thank you. A viewer told me that a long time ago. Tina never went to Great America. How no. come, Tina? I don't Wait, know how really? it is. I don't know how it is now, but I know there used to be a Great America in St. Louis too, because I remember when I was a kid, my parents took us there. But I never went on the roller coasters. I don't know what I was this too tea low. is, but it's really not good. Okay, we'll stop drinking it then. I think it's. I put salted caramel um, sugar in it. That shouldn't happen. Okay. So, let me see. What do you guys think so far? What do you Love think? It. I like the fake leather at the bottom. I do, too. Okay, but we got to fix this top because the top looks a little janky. Sherry Wolf, the tip was taking your heat gun to get those glue strings all off. Okay. You know that, though. <laughs> let me get... You got to build the top up. Yeah. That's, I think you got to build that out more. Honey. Just saying. <laughs> Uh, Diane's husband, Army Ranger, and then the old Gulf in Washington, D.C. And never went to the Sears Tower either. Wait, Tina from Illinois? Who? Tina. Tina? Tina Presley. Ask her. Tina, where are you from again? she's the one that said she was from Illinois. I never went to Great America, she said. Yeah. Doesn't mean she's from Illinois. She could have went to Great America. They they allow people from out of state to go to Great America. <laughs> Stop being so. Don't forget, as you guys are hopping on, um, at the towards the end, I will be doing where I'm going to pick somebody. I'm watching the comments. I can kind of see how long you've been here. Um, we have a calendar giveaway. And the way it's going to work is I'm just going to pick a random name, and then you're going to pick a number, one through five, and then whatever number you pick is going to correspond with the calendar that I send you. Okay. So that looks a little better. So you just got to beef up that top. Okay. So uh, Tina said, I, uh, oh, no, not Tina. Natalie said, oh, no, not Natalie. Hold on. <laughs> Melissa said, what's the difference? That's how fast the comments go, ladies. Melissa said, what's the difference in a number 10 and a number 20 biscuit? It's um, the size. So a number 10 is smaller than a 20. Okay, um, so look, I've got a thousand biscuits. Like I said, these from Amazon are much better than the ones from Harbor Freight or other ones. I, I think the ones at Harbor Freight are cheaper, um, but I like the feel of these versus the other one. But the number is the size. So these are size 10, um, so that just means the size of the biscuit. But look, I just have, so this is a box of thousand. And I think I have 950 more to go. So <laughs> stay tuned. <laughs> uh, oh, thank you. Lisa answered too. Yes, they're smaller. Okay, so there we go on that. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to take some white. 
and I have some gold. So what I thought we would do is we would dry brush. So when you dry brush, you just take your brush, and here's my puppy pad, and wipe off your paint. You just want, like, a dry brush. Yeah, Lowe's has the DeWalt brand. You're right. Yeah, um, they do. And then you're just going to take your brush with it being dry. So you're not painting your biscuits like solid. If you want to paint them solid, go for it. Um, Someone posted last time you started the tree from the top. Oh, did the I? The tree from the top. I won't get. I don't. I that. This tree, that tree, I've never done before. So, yes, if I did the other one the other way. They turn out really the same. Yeah, they they're really very do. similar. So you're just going to go in here. Uh, Rob, Robin asked, are you going to plan on making more babies with the paint? No. <laughs> no. Where did she come up with this stuff? <laughs> oh, Charlotte just signed up for the club. Yay! Welcome. How did you see that? I saw it on there. Welcome. And my phone dings or ding dings. Ding dings? <laughs> ding, ding, ding dings. Welcome, Charlotte and Pam and Arlene and Nettie. Oh my gosh. So excited. We are all so excited to have you guys. Um, we love everybody here. Please know, please know, nothing here on the page changes. We will be here just like we always are. The club is just an extension of the page. Um, that's all. Um, and we do other things there. Um, that are exclusive, and it's just a smaller um, platform, and the ladies get to know us even better. So, Sherry Stubbs said, welcome, Charlotte. <laughs> you got that right, Sherry. Um, Sherry's okay. been around for a while, too. Oh, yeah. So that's all I did with the white, but I'm going to add some gold. Isn't that pretty? It's my gold. Thank you. Okay, so... You know what? That's a good question. So Deborah asked, how do you cover the number on the biscuit? I personally, on my both trees, you can see yes. my number. So actually, the ones from Amazon have Lamello on this side and number 10 on this side. I actually didn't even notice that when I was putting it on there. If I could redo it, I would put the 10 up because it's much smaller than the lamello that I'm seeing. But really? The but really, you can't, like, when you're looking at it, you barely see it. And to me, it looks something that you'd get at a vintage antique store. It um, looks like something that you yes. get like that. So I'm going to add, again, we didn't add it on here. We don't have gold on the original biscuit tree. Um, so I'm going to add Glorious Gold by Deco Art. Somebody said you missed the top of the board. Oh, did I? Well, it was Sherry Wolf, so we're just not really sure. <laughs> Talk about Sherry. Sherry, I don't know. Andy said, I love it. Good. Rebecca's a nice tree. Okay, so I'm just going to – puppy pads are your friends. Lisa said the Home Depot ones are plain on one side, and the other side has a number. But they are different material. And Nicole just gave the direct link to the Be Inspired Market store. Oh, thank you, Nicole. Thank you. Okay. Kathy Kirby Smith said the club is a smaller group. It is more personable, personable and easier to comment to each other and Carol and Bill. And it's a lot of fun, right, Kathy? Oh, yeah. No, it's definitely more at a personal level. And they get exclusive um, And really, we're, we're not in a hurry when we craft with you ladies in the club. And Not that we are here, but generally here we like to keep it to about an hour. An hour. There, sometimes we go longer. Okay, so that's our gold. So it's just. That looks pretty good. I like it. I like it. And I forgot my water. Okay. I, I, like, I it. like it. Okay, Dawn stay said, tuned because we're going to be giving away the calendar. Don said, okay, I think you may have just topped last year's. Oh, good. Yay. Don was, uh, yeah, she said, I don't know how you could top it. So, again, here's your inspiration. You know, it's this, it's similar to the tree we have back there, but it's very different in the fact that it's smaller. It's got a different background. I like um, the stamp, though. I love IOD. the stamp from IOD. We we carry the stamp, so just comment link and go to beinspiredmarket.net. We have a few stamps left. Um, the biscuits, that's the same, but I added gold to it instead of just keeping it white. You could still do a bow on the top. I'm not doing a bow. Oh. 
Um, so, <laughs> um, oh, thanks, Deborah. Julie, hey, Julie. Rinse the brush off in your tea if you don't if you don't have time to get water. Why do water. I keep drinking okay, it? Let me go get you. Some. Where's the bucket for water? It's turning out great. Thank you. I Thanks, wanted to Robin. take care of the brush first because I'm the one that gets suckered into cleaning it. The gold uh, yeah, sets it there. off. The gold is very nice. I love the gold. And to be honest with you, I cleaned my craft room and I used to have gold leaf. And I thought gold leaf actually would take this even further. So I wish I knew where it was. I don't know where it was. So my tip to you would be instead of using the gold paint, if you Followed us here. We've done some gold leaf techniques. Um, I think gold leaf. If I find it off camera, I will do it. Because um, I think that that would really make this even pop even more. Okay. So the topper, I was kind of playing around with these things. So. Thanks for your brush. Give me the tea so we can get. Oh, oh the tea is horrible. Even the mouth things. It's horrible. Horrible. Put the berries in some of the biscuits. Oh, that's a good idea. Yes, you could definitely do that. I don't know if I have enough berries, though. So let's see. Let's see. Biscuit pumpkin for all. We actually, Stephanie, on the blog, we have a copper, copper. Yeah, we did, we did biscuits on that one. We did a huge pumpkin last year. Um, it was made out of wood, and I did biscuits in the design, and I did copper with that. Okay, let's see if we're going to do, let's see if this works. Hold on. In my, I don't have enough, but that's another cute idea. So Patrick said you could take these little berries, and you could put oh, them around. that's a good idea. That would be very cute, too, but I don't have enough. So let me see what we're going to do. Take Natalie some said, I have tiny, tiny wooden forks from my great niece's first birthday. I think I will try to use those to make a tree. That oh, would be that's cool. a good idea. That'd be a cool kitchen tree with the forks. I love how it looks against the wording. Yes, I do too. Hold on, I'm trying to I'm trying to cut this. So welcome everybody that joined. Oops. Um, and like I said, we'll only be talking about it for the next couple days. And then, and then we close up shop. Did you so, answer Kathy's about, are the biscuits after. wood? Yes, they are wood. They are wood. So the top. Kathy, that's the logo. If you're talking about that yellow mark, right? It's hard to do. Right there. That's the Be Inspired Market logo. That's the logo. See it? It's supposed to say, if you get real close to the screen, it says Be Inspired Market. Okay, I'm just playing with it before I glue it. Joyce said, I can't make, can't wait to make one of these. So, I'm thinking, I want to make that. Yes, that pumpkin. So, there were two of them. So, there were, we had our wooden bead pumpkin, and then we had the one that had the, um, I don't know why the dog is under there again. What the heck just happened? Stuff went flying. Okay. Let's see. Kind of, kind of digging that. Let's see. Let's see. Can't wait to make one. Joyce. Joyce Breckenridge Kopensky. Because you got the SKI after your name. Joyce, you just commented. I need you to comment a number between one and five. Joyce Kopensky, if you have SKI at the end of your name. Um, comment. Joyce Breckenridge. Breckenridge Kopensky. Comment on number one to five. Because I saw you do. It was the pumpkin with the copper. Yes. Pamela said that. Three. Um, three. She picked three. Okay. <gasps> this one. Number three. They're all numbered. So, Joyce, you're going to get this sent. Make sure you comment link and text us your address. But you get this one. This one was number three, and I'm going to mix them up as yeah. I go. Joyce, so, let me write her name on it so we know it. Calm down. So, yay! 
Yay! Don't forget to go to the comment link and then get on our texting. Yes. And then text me the address. It'll go out tomorrow, I promise. I'm really good with shipping. Same with IOD transfers. If you guys go to the website, you guys pick this IOD stencil or transfer or stamp, it'll go, go out tomorrow, tomorrow morning, yeah. I promise. Oh. My glue gun is dying. That one's dead, too. Congrats, Joyce. Yes. Okay. Is this coming out fun? How fun is this? Okay. And we have such a great group of we ladies. We do. You Everybody's guys have been so fun. Joyce. Congratulating her. That's awesome. Oh, Patty, I just picked Joyce. So I said I was just going to pick a random person's name um, and then have her pick a number one to three. Nettie said, I just told Jeff, I'm assuming her husband, I need some of these biscuits in the in the garage. Yeah. <laughs> the look he just gave me was priceless. Right? Most of them are like, what? Nettie, it's okay. Carol's ordered rocks from Amazon before. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's the joke with, uh, in the club. with Nicole's husband. <laughs> oh, thanks, Jody. Okay. All right. So. Mavis uh, said... I'm confused about the cost. Did you quote a monthly cost or was that for a whole year? I'm very interested in joining. Uh, it's a monthly cost. So if you go to DIY, if you comment DIY Club and you get the link, it will be on there. But it is uh, a monthly reoccurring. You can cancel at any time. I don't hold you to a contract or anything like that. Um, but, but I will say. You won't say, be able to get back in no, until we open back until up. Until we reopen. And most of the ladies are in there since we opened. Melissa Lindsay said, I'm typing DIY club and I'm not getting a link. Hey, Nicole Richard, could you send Melissa the link? I don't think I can do it from here. Can you just send her the, yeah, I don't know where she needs either. to go for that? Sorry, Melissa. Stephanie says, I'm ready for the holiday decor, fall and Christmas. Yes, we're gonna start fall in August, in August. Rocks. And any of the ladies that are already in the club, I mean, Okay, tell, let's see. Tell them what, how you feel. That's pretty awesome. Right. Please and thank you, Melissa said. It's coming, Melissa. All right. So let's... Ooh, okay. I that like, looks good, right? I like that better than a bow. I know. I am not a bow maker. I you do, did good on that do, bow, though. Yes, I do yeah. try. I do try. But, okay. Thanks, guys. Oh, love how this is turning out. Good. Thanks, Nicole. Okay. I'm blocking it for the big reveal on purpose. So comment DIY club if you're interested in getting info on the club. That, that'll be my last time. I'm sure Carol will mention it one more time. Okay. Note to self, because I just saw them shrink up when you do the little heat gun. Be, excuse me. Be careful of your greenery because it does, excuse me, shrink up. Okay. That just said, I'm putting my Christmas decor up in November. I, well, Actually, yeah, we did last picture. year. We did after Thanksgiving. I'm taking a picture real quick. Sorry. We did after Thanksgiving. The weekend of yes, Thanksgiving we did. We, did. we yes, were we so did. excited. Okay. Replay. Brenda, we're still live. <laughs> we love you, Brenda. We do. We're here, Brenda. Um, hold on. Let me get these little berries in here because they're just going to go to waste. Kenny McDonald said, fun, fun, fun. Sue Watt said, this is oh, gorgeous. Good. Kirsten Dirtle said, this is the best club around. Aww. When you sign up, right, Kirsten? They have to sign up first. But, yeah. Well said, very elegant. Thank you, guys. And like I said, take that inspiration. Have fun with it. Look at a piece and just make it your own. It, to sit at a craft table and create is therapy. I say that wholeheartedly because it's pulled me through some things um, that has happened in my life. Lots of times, I mean, it's not always pretty and rosy and everything. And I think creativity helps with that. Um, Heather said, loving it. My noise goes. Julie McLean oh. said, I love the club. I'm never leaving. <laughs> uh, <laughs> How do I get to try making the pumpkin with the Linda, just comment link and go to our blog, beinspiredmarket.net. If you comment and you can do in the search bar pumpkin, you can see it. It's on there. So beautiful. Okay. You guys want to see? Dawn said the club is like, uh, she said, OMG, the club is like family craft night. Uh, it, it is. is Dawn. It is. Look how cool. Isn't that, I love that. Look. I like the leather at the bottom. I, I love the leather. So cool. 
I love the little leather. And that's, again, that's, that's a, a paper roll. But, ladies, you can go crazy. You can put, like, Patches had the idea of taking those little berries and putting the little berries. How cute would that be if you took those berries and you painted the berries gold? Um, and did your background in white. And then I said the gold leafing. So there's so many possibilities with it. Um, they want you to hold it in front of the camera again, but hold yes. it up a little longer. Just yes, in case yes, you guys yes. want to snap a picture of it or something. It will be on the blog. But, yes, you can see. I love that. That That is one of my favorites, I think. For real. <laughs> Rebecca said, oh, my gosh, Brenda, I love it. Brenda Dennis said, Carol and Bill, you two are just so humble and kind. Aww, thank Thanks, you. Brenda. So, I, so again, this is, <laughs> this is the original Christmas uh, biscuit tree that we did. Can't remember if it was last year or the year before. Um, and this, I think, people have asked if I'm going to put it up in auction, and I don't think I will, um, just because it's one of the most popular pieces I've ever done live. Um, and then this is our little knee. Lisa loves the smaller one more than the bigger Do you? one. Oh. Yeah. I don't Lisa's mean to really, do that, but <laughs> I love this one more than the original. She said it's nice, small, and chunky. Yes, I, I do love so, it. So my thought on it was when we were, we were discussing this before you we went on live. My thought on it was this one you would display in a bigger section of your home. Yes. The smaller one you could put on a counter or on your mantle where it's not taking up a lot of room. Maybe you have your TV above your mantle. You could put this right underneath the TV. And I'm never turning around because that was not a good look. <laughs> you could make a great angel with these. Yes, absolutely. Looks like a little angel. Oh, that's so cute. Good. What size is the mini again? The mini, the board was 8 by 11. Sharon said, uh, But I will say, if you wanted to make it a little longer, you could go 9 by 12 and then just not cut that bottom part of your tree. Sharon said, Where the writing is coming across showing what you're saying, it's in Chinese or Japanese writing. Why is that happening? Uh, I was just wondering. Very strange. I don't know. No, I think she means on here. Oh, on there? I don't know. <laughs> Are you guys, is the rest of you getting like Chinese or Japanese writing? Can't wait to make this, Sue said. Perfect. So, Joyce was our winner for our calendar tonight. Thank you so much. Birdie said, just like a warm buttered biscuit. Awesome. Uh, uh, make sure you guys comment, spread the honey on the replay as well. Um, thanks, Lisa. And Lisa just joined our club. We're super excited. Um, perfect in my kitchen. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, guys, we are going to hop off. Thank you again for day nine. We will be back tomorrow. Get on our texting list. We'll let you know the times. Um, tomorrow's project, uh, and we're just going to finish off the rest of this week celebrating the DIY Club opened. Um, we're opening now until Saturday, and then we're going to finish off Christmas in July. So, nope, English. English, yeah. good. <laughs> Sorry, yes, Sharon. Patches, another great hostess gift. Good. Lots of people you guys can gift this to for sure. All right. We love you guys, and we will see you tomorrow. Have uh, a great Laura, night. Laura asked, what time does the club meet? Uh, we typically meet on Mondays at 8 p.m. Eastern. Um, so that's the time that we typically meet. Uh, but, but you can always watch the, the replay. replay. Sorry yep. for interrupting. Yep. I didn't know you were going to mention that. Yes, always watch the replays. Well, not me. Night, night, Jody. All right. Bye, guys. Welcome to everybody who's new, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, bye. guys. Have a good night. Be safe. I know there's a lot of storms out there, so be safe. Bye, guys.